Choosing a home is one of the most important decisions we face in our lifetime. If you can afford it, most people invest in an elegant home with incredible amenities. But sometimes you don't want to flaunt this wealth and keep your home hidden from the public. From hobbit houses to cavern abodes, we are exploring the 15 most incredible hidden homes. Edgeland House is the result of a collaboration between the Austin, Texas Wildflower Center and famed urban planning firm Bercy Chen Studio. Based loosely on the design of early Native American pit houses, this private residence along Austin's Colorado River is not only visually stunning, but environmentally sound. The space used to house an oil pipeline, but after the industrial project was abandoned, the Wildflower Center reclaimed the land and planted the roof with a stunning array of local plants. And this roof isn't just beautiful, it also functions as a natural insulator, keeping the house cool in the summer and warm in the winter. The thriving urban ecosystem created a massive trend in Texas, where many homeowners are digging their foundations into the earth in order to cut down on cooling costs in the sweltering summer heat. The Edgeland House still stands as an icon of design and sustainable living. Living under a rock takes on a whole new meaning with Cliffhaven. The creatively designed house in remote southeastern Utah is built directly into its surrounding red rock formations. The 12-acre Wild West escape gazes over vast and incredible views of Montezuma Canyon. Currently for sale, the property has three bedrooms, two bathrooms, a two-car garage, and a large outdoor patio. For those who love their privacy, the closest neighbor is a mile away. The property is also self-sufficient. Solar panels power the entire house, while a private well provides fresh water and a 12,000-gallon cistern collects rainwater and runoff. There's a backup diesel generator to ensure power as well. When the original homeowner built the property in 1986, they created a tunnel behind the house to help with water runoff and create a natural fresh air circulation system. Throw in a vineyard, vegetable garden, and a mature orchard. Think apples, peaches, cherries, and more. And you've got the makings of a complete off-the-grid cave castle. The Vivos Group is a construction company that builds doomsday structures for the world's elite in case there's a catastrophic disaster. But their crown jewel is the Vivos Europa, valued at more than $1 billion. It's an invitation-only compound for the rich that will hold up during earthquakes, tsunamis, chemical attacks, and even a nuclear blast in Rothenstein, Germany. Plus, the five-star doomsday shelter features everything you would expect from the ultimate doomsday escape, including swimming pools, gyms, theaters, helicopter services, restaurants, and gorgeous custom apartments. The now luxury shelter was once built by the Soviets in the Cold War as a fortress for military equipment. And amazingly, the structure is expected to house up to a thousand people, a small zoo, storage for cultural treasures, and a gene bank for reconstituting plants and animals after a possible extinction event. All it will take is a few million dollars to reserve your spot at Vivos Europa. Akrafjorden is a scenic fjord in western Norway. It is not part of the main tourist circuit, meaning that the fjord is generally reserved for adventurous locals with a knack for wilderness living. But deep in this vast ecosystem lies a subterranean house that blends perfectly with its surroundings. The Norwegian architecture firm Snowheda custom-built this one-of-a-kind house that can comfortably hold 21 people, though you would never guess this from the exterior. The tiny house also manages to make space for a fireplace, stove, and beds that double as seating. But only visit this house if you're physically fit. The journey involves a multi-hour hike from the nearest paved road, but the results are worth it. Guests can take in an amazing view and a fully remote glamping experience. In Ozark, Arkansas, built deep inside a rocky living cave, is a four-bedroom home listed for $2.75 million. The structure was originally built in the early 1980s as a bomb shelter, when the threat of a nuclear war with what was then the Soviet Union loomed. Over the years, the home has undergone a number of renovations, its most recent taking three years and $1 million, according to the New York Times. Amenities include a honeymoon suite, gourmet kitchen, big screen TV with satellite, Wi-Fi, fire pit, grill, and patio area. The living room has custom-built furniture with oversized couch and chairs, 72-inch smart TV with satellite, Wi-Fi, and its very own Spanish piano waterfall, a naturally made, totally unique rock formation with trickles of spring water falling into cascading pools. This underground location is perfect for an eccentric millionaire with money to burn. When you think of rustic living, Manhattan is probably the last place you imagine. But there is a new trend of New York's elite building cabins on the roofs of skyscrapers. The quaint locale has a front porch and an outdoor dining area, so residents can enjoy the bucolic view of the Lower East Side. And the cabin is available to rent for the altogether reasonable price of $4,200 a month. The interior of the home reveals a penthouse and a full kitchen. 
The home has been used as a staycation getaway since the 1980s and ushered in a new era of second homes in the Big Apple. But the house recently went back up on the market, and the owners revealed interior shots showing potted plants, loungers, a sun umbrella, and other accessories inspiring of a dreamy country life. A swimming pool on the roof of this concrete residence by Brazilian office studio MK27 sits within the dense canopy of a coastal rainforest in Sao Paulo State. Concrete and wood are the two primary ingredients that went into the building's construction. Their simple, clean lines perfectly playing off the dense, mountainous topography and engulfing foliage. Elevated on two pillars, the home is orientated on the side of the mountain, taking advantage of the amazing ocean views and bright sunlight, and is separated into three stories, offering the home's inhabitants multi-purpose function from the bottom up. The three levels of the jungle house create a clear division of spaces. The ground floor houses a large covered timber deck, connected to a small room for the children. On the first floor there are six bedrooms, five of them with small verandas with hammocks and a TV room. The second floor is the social area of the house, including the swimming pool, the living room, and the kitchen. Back in 2015, design images for Casa Brutal went viral and set the internet on fire. Now, this mesmerizing concept has been brought to life. Although the structure looks complicated, it's made from simple materials, wood, glass, and concrete. Where do things get tricky? The roof is a clear glass bottom pool, and you need an elevator or 50 stairs to get inside. And the whole structure being built into the side of a cliff thing certainly lends an air of grandeur. Sitting on an altitude of 1600 meters on Fakra Mountain, the house is just a mere 150 meters below the mountain's peak. What was initially planned to be 180 square meters will now become upsized to 270 square meters, enough for the desired six bedrooms, garage for three vehicles, rooftop pool, and more. Not only is the remote home beautifully placed on the side of the cliff, the rooftop pool creates an optical illusion that casts stunning aqueous patterns all over the interior. The project will cost at least $2.5 million to construct, and many expect it to sell for upwards of $5 million. Falling Water is easily one of the most famous buildings in the world. The house is the crown jewel of Frank Lloyd Wright's career, and rightfully so. After its completion, Time called it his most beautiful job, and it is listed among Smithsonian's life list of 28 places to visit before you die. And the area is about to fill with even more unique architecture. Vancouver architects Pat Cow have designed a series of subterranean houses in the surrounding fields. The cottages will reside in the hills of the 5,000-acre Bear Run Nature Reserve that surrounds Falling Water. The underground, sustainably designed cottages were recently selected through a design competition held by the Western Pennsylvania Conservancy, which manages Falling Water, along with the many educational programs that are part of the historic home. The design competition asked for proposals that fit in with the surrounding landscape and could be constructed in harmony with nature. The underground cottages will utilize the natural heating and cooling properties of the surrounding earth, recycle gray and kitchen water for use in the toilet and will feature environmentally friendly materials and solar passive design. Almost 100 years after Falling Water was designed, it is still inspiring world-class architecture. Found in the picturesque fields of Hampshire, Southern England, the Wishing Park Estate is a one-of-a-kind property that is almost invisible when viewed from above. The six-bedroom house is a stunning addition to the beautiful landscape. It sits on a 43-acre site with its own private fishing lakes and woodland, and the design was built with a rich buyer in mind. The house went on the market for just shy of 5 million pounds, but the new owner will have heaps of amenities, including an indoor sports hall, swimming pool, and a 100-square-foot main living space. Beyond that is the huge garden that includes a helipad, football pitch, and adventure playground with a zip wire. Yet on the surface, the house is no bigger than a simple, modest cottage. Back in 1915, a 14-year-old boy found a gemstone in the remote South Australian outback. From this discovery, Cooper Petty was born, a remote, fiercely hot place of a few thousand inhabitants today, sustained by its supply of opal and curious visitors. On the surface, Cooper Petty is an ugly, windswept plain. But dig a little deeper and you'll find a luxurious getaway. Indigenous people have lived underground here before recorded history. When miners came to collect opal from the area, they continued this trend. Most residents continue to live underground to this day, and many have incredible homes, including underground swimming pools and luxury hotels. You can even go to one of the town's many underground bars and restaurants. 
Warsaw, Poland is home to the world's skinniest house, which doubles as an art installation. Designed by Polish architect Jakub Szczesny, the Karet House in Warsaw is wedged inside a four-foot crevice, designed as a cushion of air between two buildings. The Karet House stretches over 30 feet tall, but is simultaneously only 28 inches wide at its narrowest point, thinner than a stovetop, and just four feet wide at its widest. The house was built for famed Polish-Israeli filmmaker and writer Edgar Karet, Karet said he was moved by the construction of the house, as his family hasn't had one in Warsaw for the past 70 years. At a press conference which took place in October 2012, Karet said that it was the first time he'd come to Poland not as a tourist or a writer promoting a book. Then, he was coming home. Though most people are not clamoring to live in such a cramped space, there's a long waiting list for this now-famous home. Karet says that he will pass it on to a friend or colleague when he moves out. From the exterior, this barn is just a sheet metal construction. No one would take a second look at this simplistic home, which would traditionally hold a boat, car, or airplane. However, Morton Buildings designs these homes to be as opulent as necessary. These can house prized car collections and even indoor casinos. Many people even opt for fun features like an indoor swimming pool or a bowling alley. And best of all, these houses are completely inconspicuous, so you can keep a modest appearance while treating yourself to unimaginable splendor behind closed doors. Gil Bartolome architects have expounded upon the concept of extreme living with Casa del Acantilado in Granada, Spain. Completed in 2015 for a young couple with an imagination as limitless as the architects, but with a finite budget. At first sight, the home looks like the love child between a futuristic spaceship and a mythical sea creature scaling the heights of the cliff face. A study of juxtapositions, the unique design of its organic shapes both caused the home to stand out as well as fit into the jagged and complex landscape. The interior of this cave-like home has a sleek two-tier living room that accommodates up to 70 guests for dancing and dining. Visitors can also lounge on the balcony or in a pool overlooking the Mediterranean Sea. This is undeniably one of the most lavish hidden homes in the world. Thank <laughs> you.